Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. Before I get into it, it'd be massively appreciated if you went ahead and dropped a like on the video. Cheers. So a bit of transfer news has came out today in Glasgow. And like I've said on the channel multiple times now, we won't only see new players brought in the door this summer, but we will also see players move on who might not have a future for us in Glasgow. So I actually done a video previously on the channel, going on to speak about how midfielder Josh McPay could be set to leave Ibrox this summer. However, it's now been confirmed that the Rangers midfielder is now signed for Queen's Park. So the Scottish Championship side have won the race to sign the midfielder, ahead of a number of clubs north and south of the border looking at him this summer. It's also being said that Josh McPaig was very keen to stay in Scotland and Queen's Park will offer him regular first team experience in his career. So Josh McPaig actually came for the youth ranks in Glasgow, signing for the club from Hibs back in 2013. And since then he's been on a handful of loan deals away from Glasgow, with his most recent loan deal coming at Tranmere Rovers where he would go on to play 14 games for them, only managing to score once before he would return to Glasgow. So according to transfermarket.co.uk, Josh McPake has a current value of 68000 with his current deal set to expire in the summer of 2024. So what do you guys think then? Personally I think this is good business by Ross Wilson. I think we all know at this stage he wasn't going to be on our plans next season. And with how much loan deals he's had as well, it's probably for the best that we sell him for a permanent fee and go our separate ways with the player now. Like I've said in multiple videos on the channel, it will always be a sad day when players from the youth set up leave the club for whatever reason. And I think it will be good to get him off the wage bill, while also getting some money in the door for him. Although I can't imagine it being too much cash up front, and it might be more of a clause situation where we get more cash if he does well and stuff like that, which I think will be good and we could end up with more money than just selling him for a box standard fee. Like I said though, it's always sad to see these players leave, because that's obviously the end of their Rangers dream, and I think all we can do is wish them the best in their football career. But let me know what you guys think down in the comments, and subscribe for daily videos. Cheers.